We've been making a lot of great progress in 576. If you've been following along, you've seen all the projects that we've been working on, but here you can actually see it in action and what the final product will be. Over here to my right is the working air pump and the Emory Rail Heritage Trust just gave us a generous grant to rebuild ours. That's in the process right now. Now this locomotive has wheels. We don't have wheels right now. Those are down in Chattanooga being serviced. Our lubricators are back up in working order. The hot water pump, that is ready to go on 576 in storage awaiting a reapplication. One of the incredible things about a steam locomotive is its ability to draw a crowd. If you look over to my right, I mean, we're right between runs right now, so it's not even moving, but we have people on the bridge, underneath the bridge, over here to my right, all with cameras. And trackside, we've been seeing cars with license plates from all over the place coming right here to see number 765 in action. And that's the same kind of excitement and draw we want to bring to Middle Tennessee with an operating steam locomotive in number 576. All right, I'm here with Pete and Jack from Rochester, New York. And what brings y'all out today? Well, nickel plate 765. Okay, is this your first time or have you seen it before? Many times before. Right. And when he was old enough to, to see it and big right enough here. to do a car ride, started coming here with him in 2014. So would you come down to Nashville to see number 576 in operation? Absolutely. Yeah. All right, glad to hear that. This is a crucial time right now in the restoration, and we are in need of additional memberships, donations, support to really get us to that final piece to see 576 look like what's standing behind me today. 